everybody, welcome back to Villains and Vice. I'm Beth, and today I have another mystery box unboxing. companies. The one that is restructuring because it had a lot of unhappy customers and this is the only box I've ever gotten from them. It took four and a half months to get here. It was one of those specially themed boxes. It's the Walt Disney and Mickey Mouse themed box and I was like well I have to have that. Took forever to get here, then the company went under or are restructuring, and I have just been sitting on this box for months. So it's, I mean, we're creeping up on a year since I think I placed the order for this box. And I went back and forth about what to do with it, but I was like, you know what? We paid for it. We got the top tier, the $300 box, because it's Walt Disney. I mean, it's Walt. I'm going to open it. So, now that I've prefaced it with all of that, let's actually check out the box. It's huge. Cut her open. There is a lot of tape. So, rather large. All the best. I don't know how to do this. It's rather big. Now it has bright green tissue paper and a sticker from the company not to be named. <laughs> but let's just rip it open and see what's inside. Alright, we got trash, glitter bag. So one of the very first things I see is this cute like canvas bag. It has the Disneyland D 2021 and then it has Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Goofy, Pluto. Did I said Pluto? It's Pluto. Very cute. That's kind of like a primary color zipper. Oh, pretty spacious inside and there's a, a pocket inside, which I love that. I love bags that have extra pockets. Oh, there's even more detail on the side. This is Disneyland Resort. Very, very cute. Oh, and it's different on the other side. Oh, it's got Haunted Mansion on the other side. Okay, okay, so, so far so good. So far so good, I like this. Got this little guy, don't know what this is. <laughs> it's a little, a little Mickey mirror. Oh, it's like, it's rubber. <laughs> cute, very cute little like purse mirror. What else do we have here? <laughs> a little autograph book, which I'm actually not going to open because I'll probably give it to either my niece or nephew, but very cute. Gang's all there, the autographs on the back. There's a Disney Cruise Line Happy New Year 2021 pin. It's a 
pin on pin as Mickey and Minnie and they're holding 2021 balloons. That's really cute. And I'm a pin collector now. <laughs> so, uh, this will go right on my cork board. Very nice. Got some pencils. Oh yeah, there are Mickey heads on some of them. At first I just thought they were cherries. It's like, that's a really random thing to say. But there are Mickey heads on on some of them. What to do first? Okay, so I'm going to I'm gonna start with the box because it's on top. I feel like I'm so far away from you guys. It is a box. Mm -hmm. Interesting. And whatever's inside is bubble wrap, so packed well by the looks. Just extra bubble wrap and save that. Oh, okay. So this just slid out. It is a certificate of verification. Disneyland dedication plaque. Cast in Renaissance brass. Made exclusively for Disney parks and resorts. Oh, and it's numbered. That's really cool. Disneyland, to all who come to this happy place, welcome. Disneyland is your land. Here, age relives fond memories of the past, and here, youth may savor the challenge and promise of the future. Disneyland is dedicated to the ideals, the dreams, and the hard facts that have created America, with the hope that it will be a source of joy and inspiration to all the world. July 17th, 1955. I don't know how we'll display it. It's really cool and I would like to hang it, but I don't think it's designed to be. It has like little beats on the bottom, but I do like that. That's amazing. Got this. <laughs> Castaway Key Surf Shack, Disney Cruise Line. Just a, a cute little Mickey magnet. You never have too many magnets, especially if they're cute ones. And then I'm hoping these are artwork. <laughs> oh, 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 my gosh. <laughs> ah. Look at Mickey. That's funny. It is titled All Aboard. It's by Kristen Tursick. There's a card in the back that tells all about her, but this is super cute. Kind of Ren and Stimpy-ish. One last guy. This is Minnie. This is called Time Well Spent. This is by David McNeely, also known as McBiff. <laughs> These are very like Art Deco kind of artwork pieces, but very, very cute. So, I think that's it. so real talk. I can see why people aren't maybe thrilled with that company. Um, this was a $300 box. That was $40. This was $30. I don't know how much this plaque was, but I'm sure that was pretty expensive. And then, you know, the bag and magnet pencils, a pin, autograph card. Um, it was nowhere near as good as my Bippity boxes are every month that are like half the price. I like all of the things. I um, don't love everything. It was billed as a the man and the mouse box and there is very little of Walt Disney. It's this. I was expecting there to be like partner statue things or you know portraits
portraits of Walt, you know, a picture of Walt, maybe like drawing Mickey or, you know, with Mickey. So it's fine. <laughs> um, I'm glad I opened it because now I know what's in the box. You may see some of these items in future giveaways. Like I said, the artwork is cute. It's not really my style. Um, <laughs> I don't know, maybe, maybe they'll grow on me. Maybe Michael really like them. We'll have him uh, take a look at everything. The value for this box is, is lacking. $300, no way, no way. I can see why they had to kind of pack up things and regroup because they just weren't getting the job done. So anyway, <laughs> that's my honest opinion. <laughs> okay, not great. But thank you guys for sticking with me. <laughs> Did you see anything in the box that you really liked? Did you think that this was worth $300? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe and we will see you next time. <laughs>